Hello friend, I'm Dr. Faiz Rahman, Chairman Founder of Good News India. October 1998, I found myself preaching to a small group of people in a remote village on the border of Orissa and Bengal in eastern India. When the service was done, the local pastor, with a heart to nurture destitute and orphan children, asked if I would help him with funding and resources. At first I hesitated due to the sheer implications of his request. But then I remembered that I too was a child 30 years earlier, when I was in need and my folks could not afford to look after me. I was growing up in Calcutta, known for years as the hellhole of the world. In many ways, I was just like the children that were standing in front of me. And when he asked if I could help him, I knew that this was my destiny. And I said yes, and Good News India was born. What is Good News India? It is children, some 2,400 of them scattered across eastern India in 26 orphanages. We call them dream centers. We want to touch some of the 70 million children that basically fend for themselves in trying desperately to survive across the vast land of India. We allowed our 10-year-old son to make the choice of which child we would sponsor. He looked at all the faces and, and basically picked a child that was about his age. And so we've involved the family in that, in the prayers for, uh, for the children over there. And it's just been one more thing that we can do as a family, one more thing that we can serve together uh, in a way that will benefit someone else. These are my acres of diamonds who are excelling in academics, sports and arts in their schools. What else is Good News India? It is a home for high-risk girls in the foothills of the Himalayan mountains. Tragically, some 80% of the girls that work at the brothels of India are forcibly brought down from the northeastern hills of India. Many of them will die of AIDS or other transmitted diseases before they leave their teen years. Good News India has a dream center where we have rescued almost 95 girls under the care of a loving couple. What else is Good News India? It's a haven, a shelter for people struck by leprosy. Good News India has taken over five leper colonies and we have built our own city of refuge for lepers. We're reaching out to almost 500 lepers. We have more than 120 of their children, darling, beautiful children, free from leprosy but still carry the stigma of coming from a leper home. Please pick up the phone and call us at the number on your screen or log on to our website at goodnewsindia.org. Arts uh, contributed to my life in many ways. Uh, I've met a lot of wonderful people. Uh, as a, you know, the creative world is it's a fun thing. It's like child's play, really. It's work as well, but it's also a lot of fun. Your lips are kissing. Somebody new. I'm out of the picture. Out of the view. Please come back to me because I don't.